Wait, what the fuck? What's that red stuff on the thumbnails? Is YouTube broken? Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Stephanie, and today I'm going to be talking about a couple of YouTube changes, which I really haven't done on this channel before. So if you guys want to see what the changes are, please stick around and let's get started. Thumbnails have recently changed, if you guys haven't noticed. Beforehand, when you had already watched a YouTube video, the video would turn a bit opaque, and then on the left hand side it said watch and then the length of the video still remained on the right hand corner. So now when you have watched a video in its entirety, instead of saying watch, there's a red line at the bottom of the screen and now that means that you have watched that video. So if you watched half the video, then only half the line is going to be there. If you watched a quarter, only a quarter of the line is going to be there. And that's how you keep track of the videos you have watched now. This is actually going to give creators a lot more opportunities to work with their thumbnail because beforehand we only had kind of like a backwards Z of space and now we actually have all that left hand corner that won't be blocked out. So if you're a creator, I hope that this helped and if you're not, well at least you know what the red line at the bottom of the screen means now. Another big important change that is going to be rolling out on YouTube is like Twitter have the option to pin a top comment in your comment section of your videos. So if it's a comment that you posted that you want everyone to see or that someone posted that you really had a connection with, you're going to be able to pin the top comment on the comment section and related to that, there's also going to be an option to heart a comment. The purpose of being able to like or part comments is to have more of a one-on-one -on -one relationship with your subscribers and along with that, when you reply to a comment or you comment on a video, your username is going to be highlighted and if you're a verified user, you're going to have a check mark. The last thing that I want to talk to you guys about is mobile end cards. YouTube has recently made it super easy for us to have end cards both on desktop and mobile and it helps a lot with the mobile users because now you can actually click to subscribe and not have to look for the subscribe button. So shameless plug in, you can click on my face and this video to subscribe to my channel. And if you guys thought this tip was useful, please give this video a thumbs up. I really do hope that you guys enjoyed and learned something from this video. If you haven't subscribed yet, please go ahead and click that subscribe button. I also have a vlog channel. If you guys haven't checked that out, please go ahead and do so. And also, if by the time you're watching this video, you haven't voted yet, please go out there and vote because the country needs your vote today. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Miss for both. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.